What is up, Neophytes? My name is Alan, aka Neo Crypto, and welcome back. Or welcome to, should I say, something new. Guys, I have been playing the other level crap out of this. My friend Dave gave this to me, uh, kind of as a Christmas slash birthday present. It's Monster Hunter World, if you haven't heard of it. Um, well, I, I think you're gonna enjoy it, because I am just, like, thoroughly freaking addicted to it. It's all about hunting monsters, and there's... Yeah, well, we're just gonna dig into it here. I have two characters, we're gonna make a third character <laughs> that way we can start over so you guys can see it from the very beginning. So, but here's like my main character so far and my other character. We're gonna make a waifu, cause why not? I, I, we're gonna be looking at this character for a while, so waifu time, I am thinking. But there's a cutscene, so I'm gonna shut up and let you guys hear it as soon as it loads, which would be now. I'm stalling for time. Sisters and brothers of the Fifth Fleet, it's time. I'll keep my farewell brief. Never was much with words. Once you board this ship, there's no turning back. The next ground your feet will touch will be that of the New World. If any of you have lost your nerve, then step away now and let no one judge you. Very well. Then sail safe and... Believe you me, I get it. Anything could happen to us, but hey, that's yep. happened. Uh. Hey, aren't you one of the A-list hunters? What? No way! So are we! Hey, tell us your name. Alright guys, this is where we can jump into character creation. I am probably going to make a cut here while I make my character. And uh, I'll bring you back. As soon as we're done, I might actually bring you back when I go to customize our Palico because the Palicos are kind of neat and yeah, it, it's our like partner and stuff. So we'll see. All right, guys, I have my uh, character done. We have my glorious waifu, <laughs> Lorena McCryptor. I think she came out pretty cool. Um, the face paint, can't really tell right there, but it's metallic, which is kind of neat. So let's go ahead and say, yep. That name's okay. Now let's take a look at our Palico, and our Palico is a cat, obviously, because meow. So let's go ahead and take a quick look here. With the I think I'm gonna, I might just go with the default. I don't know. <laughs> evil looking kitty. What's this evil? I don't know. That's adorable. Meow. Um. We're going to go, because we're going to customize it a little bit. You know what, we'll, we'll just do that. Let's just confirm that. Let's go into our fur palettes here, and... Oh, we could give him perp, the lights perps. Neat. Um, I think we're going to... I actually think we're going to adjust his fur thickness a little bit. Let's go with there and let's make him a longer hair. I don't know what that really does. It uh, like decreases some of the uh, grain of the texture. Although on the legs you can actually see uh, it does seem to have gotten a longer. Uh, we'll, you know, I think we're gonna keep that uh, pattern. Let's take a look at some patterns here. Okay. Tiger. That's kind of strange. Is that all the, do we only have four patterns? Oh, what do we do with no pattern? Oh, look at that. Very, very chill cat. And we messed everything up. So let's see here. You were something like that. And for these, are you giving perps? Seriously, tempted. Give him some perps. Do a little darker there. And we'll leave that white. Okay. Let's just go with that. Let's rock it and roll it. These eyes are too adorable. Angry. No. Oh no. Wait. Which is which eyes are more adorable? These? Or these? These? Or these? I think those. We're gonna give you 
some blue eyes. And when I mean blue eyes, I mean we're going to like crank up the saturation. We're going to crank up the brightness and slide this around a little bit. Oh, we get, oh there we go. A purple eye and a green eye. So let us bring that saturation up and that uh, brightness up or brightness. Ooh. Yeah. yeah. We'll go with the green. There we go. Make you kind of unique, pal. Uh, ears. I don't know. I kind of like the, for lack of better words, I kind of like double ears. With those. Tail. What do you got? Got a regular tail. Give you a zigzaggy tail, a bob tail, or an extra bushy tail. Let's go with the bushy tail. Clothing. Um, you know, let's just go black and call it good, I think. Okay, we're on voice, right? This is the tutorial, but it's a cool tutorial-ish tutorial. It's the whole movement thing. Uh, 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 uh. Pretty much. Hello? <laughs> Anybody there? There we go. Now we can get a move on. So. Oh, hey, it's you! Yes, it's me! Look what happened to the ship! I saw! It's <laughs> there! You think? You see the big ship above us and the lava everywhere? What was your first clue? I'm just saying. It says safety. Yeah, not so much. Well, that takes care of the boat. At least. That's a thing. We need to get out of here. I've got an idea. This way. By the way, guys, I... Whoa. I've kind of Watch changed yourself. the position of my microphone, so uh, let me know how it sounds, see if uh, you notice a difference with it. Okay. Uh, uh, lava, 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 rock. Lava, rock, rock, Hurry. lava. More. Go. Oh, right behind you. Come on. Where are we going? I'm going this way. Okay. 
take some screenshots here, so uh, bear with me. That wasn't what I wanted. But, you know, whatever. Ah! Oh, I got it. I got it. Neat. And... Grab that. Because Dora Magdaros is making a key land for all. Or Flaming Godzilla bits! find a good screenshot for the thumbs. Yeah, cool. See the dragon tank flying in the distance. And we have touchdown! Maybe not the most graceful touchdown, but certainly it is. By the way, guys, if this video is extra long, I, I just don't want to cut out the beginning bits. The consecutive videos won't be as long as this one, but I have a feeling that this one might be kind of a lengthy-ish one. What's this? Somebody must have set up this camp. Because I can't run right now. I have to walk. There we go. I found this in the tent. It has a map in it. Well, part of one at least. Okay. Yeah. I love the map animation. Looks like insane. we're right around here. I about this game I really love. The research commission's base of operations is here. This is where our ship was supposed to dock. For now, I think it would be best if we make our way to base. Yeah, yeah. The map Let's do it. should help us find our way. Let's do it. Come on. I'll race you there. It's a Pariser, sort of, ish. Kind of, maybe, ish. I mentioned ish. Look, the research commission's headquarters. Come on, let's get going. All right, come on. Oh, wait. where where'd those scout flies go? So you, you see the little lantern on my belt. According to the map, that has to get to HQ, you need to it'll guide you in certain places. I'll show you, res bring you to resources, and ultimately help you track your monster. So, which way are we going, person? Because I know I have to follow you. These it's kind of a, oh, there we go. Every bit as docile as the ones back home. Yes, they do. I suppose. I might cut some of this out. It looks like we need to go around. Yeah. I think I probably will cuz need to go around which way hmm. something's up the scout flies are gathering so this game is all about oh yeah I'm cutting this out never what really a weird plant Oh, it's a puppy! It's a puppy! I get to pet it first! Hello, little puppy. I shall name you Fluffykins. Okay, you don't like the name. I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. Uh oh. Easy there. Is one of your friends there? Don't pick a fight if you don't have a weapon. You need to hide. Yep, let's hide. This way. I'm ahead of you. Excuse me. Got a vomitos muchacho. Shh. Oh, God. Cool. Next. You can come out now. You okay. Seriously, you can come out. Clear. Okay. Let's get going while we still can. Sounds like a plan. Can you move? Mm. 
Maybe. Can I go? It, it, whatever. Nothing can stop us. Good climbing. There's no fall damage. Ooh. Okay. So are you gonna make me climb to oh it, it's tracking her. <laughs> Come on. Let's go now. What is this track? Um whoop. Don't know. There's Let's more smell over it. There. Let's check it out. Hey. It's a skid mark of some sort. Oh. oh. You may get friends. It's a big puppy! Don't worry, I won't do anything. Look at this guy. He's a pro. That's only a clearing path. I'm moving already! Oh, well, I guess I don't have to hurry that bad. Move! Oh! What are you waiting for? Hello, Fluffy Rex! the video cinematic so far. I apologize for that. Wow. Amazing, ain't it? Just look at this gate. It's like nature meant for us to build a stara right here. A stara. I like it. <laughs> the rest of the fifth are already here. You're the last to arrive. Wait, did she say she needs to take off You're her alive. shoulder? I don't You're like up, her. Huh? Let her treat me. Well, we couldn't find you two. We were starting to sweat bullets. <sighs> you scared us. We were talking about going out to look for you. <laughs> All's well that ends well. <sighs> hey, we need a hand. Sorry. Hey, Come on. Uh, catch you Bye. later. <laughs> <laughs> this here is our trade yard. I guess the name says it all. Huh. Look at all the people. The stuff. Incredible. Right? <laughs> We've got it all here. We've got hunters to do all the exploring. Scholars to do the research. Technicians to keep them going. But do you have a McDonald's? This place is the beating heart Famished. of the commission. Wait here a sec. Totally use a Big Mac, large fries, large Coke. Yeah, Man, you know what I'm saying. I found a This guy's voice just does not Welcome feel right. I don't know why. It just doesn't. All right, I have to click a button now. I must be touching mouses. Blah, 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 blah. I know. You've watched my channel. 
Go figure. Well, hey. off you go. Well, I'm going. Okay, I'll give you the grand tour. All right, guys, I'm gonna Let's skip the grand tour. Um, because well, because yeah, we'll see line. everything as they we play. Hey guys, I thought I'd bring you back for just a moment to. I just noticed something weird. For some reason, I was only recording at 30 FPS during most of this. So I apologize for that. I don't know why right. I got the, why OBS was set to 30 Come FPS, on. but it was. Yeah. But we're good now. We're on our good golden 60. Now and uh, yeah, yeah. So the uh, previous council. footage was not great. I apologize. It's a council meeting. After tracking a migrating elder dragon oh. across the sea. You sure it wasn't Godzilla? Or maybe Godzilla is a elder dragon. That that might be it too. The fifth fleet have finally arrived in Astera. Yep. They're a fine group. Yes, we are. Worthy comrades who will help see the research commission's long efforts finally rewarded. Yes, we will. Would you like to say a few words? Sure. Thank you, sir. Uh, We're ready okay, to roll up our sleeves it. and get our hands dirty. This here is the commission's core team. You should all get to know each other. Looking forward to it. Now, down to business. Uh -huh. The latest monster to make the Elder Crossing is known as Zora Magdaros. A huge monster with a mountain Godzilla. of its back. The Research Commission's job is to discover exactly what Elder Dragons have been with us, altering the ecosystem, reshaping the land, leaving disaster. I, I'm probably skipping a little bit too much. And click happy. Once every it decade happens. or so they flock to this continent. But for what reason? With the fifth's help, we will find the missing link. Here, here. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. I like that guy. Hunters, for the time being, I need you to focus on investigating our Jagras problem and securing Astera. Start by investigating the Jagras' habitat. Find out what makes. Right. We're on it, sir. We're Everyone on it. Everyone else, you know the drill. Make sure these hunters have everything they need. No. Now no. we're talking. You two. Make it a priority to learn how we do things around here. You'll find good teachers, so don't be afraid to ask. Dang, dang, dang. You heard him. Stick with me and you'll have no problems. Um, yeah. Um, sure. The fifth banner promises a change in the wind. It's your job to fulfill that promise. Okay. All right. Dismissed. All right. Well, uh, okay. <laughs> so I guess the first thing we're doing is... Mm -hmm. Go out in the field. Over here. Oh, actually, the first thing to do is to pick a weapon at, as we go into our room. So we have like a ton of weapons to work with here. You get four. There's like 14 base weapons, uh, the, and then you can build new weapons, modify them, etc., etc., etc. And by new whip, weapons, I mean new versions of the base 14. I guess you should, I should say. A lot of them are really cool. We'll probably play around with We've quite a bit of them. We've for you in that equipment box. Make sure to choose a weapon that suits you. Change equipment. Okay. Yeah, well, we, we can skip the, the little movie thing. All right. So uh, we have Sword and Shield right now. Sword and Shield is really good um, because you can use items like potions and stuff without having to put your weapon away. Um, so it works out quite well. Let's see, I think though, I'm going to start out with the dual blades. Charge axe, which is this thing, or charge sword, whatever it's, charge axe, yeah. Uh, that is like probably so far one of my favorite weapons along with the uh, Kinsect blade because you do all kinds of, this one you do all kinds of acrobatics. This one is just really freaking powerful, at least it feels like. Everybody tells me it's the most technical weapon in the game and not for beginners, I am a beginner. I really like it. To say these uh but these are fun like the dual blades it's just like you know dual well dual blades let's see chain mail do we even care right now i don't really think we care right now yeah we'll stick with the leather okay so we got a weapon equipped we're good let's back out of here okay yeah some dual blades. Get going? Uh, from here, we can talk to our housekeeper, which will. Once you're ready, head to the canteen. I'll be there waiting with a quest. Awesome. You can Good get more you. familiar with your weapons. The training area. Yeah. Just talk to the housekeeper to get started. Exactly. You can go to a training area where it has all the weapons and you can edit some attack dummies and whatnot. There's
there's a few other things you can do in here. Um, like change your Palico's equipment, things like that. Later on, you get better quarters because <laughs> that's a kind of bunks right now. All right. Handlers so. sort through the research commission's leads. And the Let's ones they deem worth our attention become quests. Hey. The team. Over here. Over here. Let's... All right. Let's right see. Survey the Jagger's habitat. Okay, give me the quest already. What are we waiting for? The you. New world awaits. Post a new quest. Now this is multiplayer co-op, so we'll get into that later. How that works, but right now we have to do this. Well, let's see. We are hunting Jagger's. Seven regular Jagger's. Those puppies that I ran into. All right. All right, guys, I think what we're gonna do is, uh, since we didn't get into any of the action, I think we're gonna call this episode one, part one, and the, I'm going to post another episode of this today. Yeah, today, right after this one, probably an hour after this one, I, I would say, uh, get rendering time and everything in. And we're gonna check out some of our first quests and see how they go. Anyway, guys, I hope you guys dig Monster Hunter. I am really enjoying this game. It is freaking amazing. And uh, it's very refreshing from what I usually play. So, yeah, let me know what you think of Monster Hunter. If you play it down in the comments below, let me know. Maybe we can team up a little bit later on and uh, do some stuff together. Until next time, guys, this is Neo, and I'll see you in game. Bye.